Immunization rates have dropped in this country over the last 20 years, and that's why one Lubbock pediatrician says it is more important than ever that families stay up to date with those shots. They're also required by the state for kids to attend school. KCBD News Channel 11's Brittany Crittenden joins us with his concerns as students head back to the classroom. Brittany? Well, Karen and Abner, Dr. Richard Lampy says that drop worries pediatricians. When it comes to encouraging more families to get their kids routine vaccinations, he says it's something parents, pediatricians, and the public can support. Whoa, fantastic. Three-year-old Calvin Ashcraft starts preschool Wednesday. His dad, Tanner, is a fourth-year medical student, so he says he's already seen the benefits of routine immunizations. And I know that that not only helps them, it helps the kids that they'll be around, our friends. When it came time for those conversations, Calvin's mom, Natalie, says there were people who told her not to vaccinate her kids. I think there's, like, so many voices out there, and, like, the loudest voices are, I don't know, like on Instagram or Facebook, and they're not always like valid. That's why they talk through it with their doctor. Dr. Richard Lampy is a pediatrician and professor who specializes in infectious diseases at the Texas Tech University Health Sciences Center. He says communication with parents is critical. I want to do what's right for children, and I know that parents want to do what's right for children, and so that's where we meet and we want to do what's right for children. Yes. When I'm in the room with a patient, I'm going to try to to help them make those hard decisions for their child as well. And that's and so I trust that my doctors are doing the same for me because I've seen it. Dr. Lampy says there are valid medical exemptions, but for most kids, the benefits of helping keep your children from getting sick far outweigh the risks of the vaccines. He says keeping kids healthy means they don't have to miss out on a week of class or soccer practice. Plus, he says it keeps parents from missing work to care for them. He says focusing on the positives is what it will take to get more of the public on board with vaccines. The public really cares about the future of its children, and when the whole public is immunized, that's better for everybody. In the early 90s, Dr. Lampy says 50 to 100 children a year were sent to the hospital with complications from chickenpox in the city of Lubbock. In the last five years, there have been none. Karen.